defense. You want to bank these early rounds if you're choking on people. These two men love each other, Chris. Just earlier this year, the two spent time together in Nicaragua. I asked Chuck Latino about becoming friends with Estrada. He said, I like friends, so why wouldn't I want more of them? A very, very pedestrian round by the very high standards these two have set. Fight, Estrada was really successful behind that jab and body shots. Chocolatito can't let him get comfortable behind that jab. Nice uppercut on the inside by Estrada right there. Chocolatito, they're surprised by his slow start. I sense that too, Todd. There's this uh, natural raw aggression that I'm not seeing so far from Chocolatito in those first two rounds. Right now, Estrada's boxing nicely off the back foot, countering. Chocolatito's not really letting them hands go like he normally is. In the end, 
set right there. He found success downstairs right there again. That's going to open up the headshots, especially in the strong stage against the ropes. Estrada's punches are heavier, too. They're sharper, they're heavier, and, and just the bounce on the step looks fresher. for Estrada. Yeah, job, jabs are rarely on the menu between these two, right, Chris? Yeah, they're power punches. Look at the 705 punches that were landed in that last fight. About 630 were power punches, so they're throwing bombs every single time. Yeah, all those punches right there, those are clean punches. Those are like shots, seven, eight punch combination with no return from Chocolate Pizza. That's unheard of, and here he comes. Nice right hand by Gonzalez there. So you can see how comfortable Mario Estrada is against the ropes now. That wasn't the case in their prior two fights. Left scores for Choco Tito. That's what you need to see more. Not one, two, or three punch combinations. Five, six, seven punch combinations from Gonzalez. The beginning of that combination was a right to the body. That's, that's something that Chocolatito always used to be good at. He dissects the points and has it comes up with the uppercuts. Nice uppercut from Edgario and a left hand. Nice combination by Gallo, but 
This is all Chocolatito so far in this round. Can Chocolatito keep up the momentum? He got the end round. Good start to the night. slower than maybe we expected, but he has gotten it going over these last six rounds. Ten seconds to go. Estrada with a flurry. He needs maybe a little bit more than that to win this round. Right hand connects. 
Estrada, but he's back on the ropes again. And that's the snap and the punches I want to see from Chavartito in the first half of the fight. Now we know he has it. Sneaky body shot by Chavartito on the inside as well. Chavartito may be in the tank, but right now the tank is running empty for Gallo Estrada.